whenever I come to things like this, I genuinely feel shivers down my spine, just how human beings give up their time, put in energy, turn up somewhere to show compassion for other people. And it takes me back to when I was about 15, 16 at the uh, Iraq war demonstrations when we all realized that our government was about to take us into an ill thought through war that would kill so many people and cause such damage. And it saddens me to be here now and think how we just really haven't learned very much since then. What ISIS do is brutal, it's barbaric, it's horrendous and no one defends that in any way whatsoever. To respond to that by bombing people without a clear diplomatic strategy is a massive, massive risk. I would remind people that Jeremy Corbyn, the leader of the Labour Party, sent an email to all the members and 70,000 people responded within 24 hours and 75% of those people said do not bomb. Do not bomb. <laughs> Momentum sent out an email to its database. We already have had over 20,000 responses of people who've written to their MPs, lobbying them, saying do not bomb. At the Labour Party conference, four conditions had to be met in order for there to be agreement to bomb Syria, and none of those conditions have been met. <laughs>